Crawford and we're here at Wake Up Nashville to bring attention to narcolepsy, a disorder that affects one in 2,000 in America. So it's something that's important to us. We want to shine a spotlight on it and we're also spotlighting some very important songwriters that entered our songwriting contest for a fundraiser. Narcolepsy is one of those things that a lot of people don't even know about. It's one of those diseases that's kind of in the middle. It's not cancer, it's not heart disease, so you don't get all that publicity. But it's not a little dinky thing either. It's kind of in the middle. So the middle stuff always gets left behind. And when I started researching it and realizing what it does and how close they are to finding a cure, and the, the thing I want to do is make sure that they get people get screened in school. And they are so close to finding an easy way to screen. We just need a little bit of money, a little bit of research. That's all, and that's why we're doing it. And my friends, the musicians, are all here to support it. Above that shines, well, I've got a good girlfriend who has a son with narcolepsy, and I have another uh, friend of mine from uh, college that's got a daughter with narcolepsy, and they're both very dear to my heart. So, so this is special for me to be able to be involved in it. We have around $45,000 at this point, so we are uh, very, very excited about that, and we hope that this evening will top us over 50000 so it's exciting. We said goodbye. and I'm here at the Wake Up Nashville event in Nashville, Tennessee. I'm writing a memoir about having narcolepsy with cataplexy. It starts, I'm a law student uh, and um, not sure what's happening to me, all the symptoms. Uh, so it goes from collapsing to the ground with cataplexy to actually running the Boston Marathon at the end. Monica Gow and David Gow are here with Wake Up Narcolepsy and we're from Massachusetts. And we are co-founders along with Kevin Cosgrove for Wake Up Narcolepsy and we were interested in starting it because our son at age 10 developed narcolepsy severely and very quickly. Uh, raising awareness and uh, trying to raise funds for uh, research is sort of our goal at Wake Up Narcolepsy. Uh, my name is Kevin Cosgrove uh, from Boston, Massachusetts and I'm uh, one of the co-founders of Wake Up Narcolepsy with David Monica Gap. Narcolepsy can present itself in mild to moderate to severe stages and in my case it presented itself shortly after college. It starts with sleepiness, but there's so much more to the disease in terms of uh, the day in the life of a narcolepsy patient other than just being tired. So I would say to be aware of not only sleepiness, but uh, how you feel when somebody tells you a joke, how you feel when you have emotion, uh, how you feel when you dream at night, how you feel when you wake up. Chance, chance. 